For the first time, a former residents of occupied East Jerusalem will be able to return home because of a new ruling by Israel's High Court. The case was brought by a 58-year-old Palestinian man who was born in occupied East Jerusalem. He had lost his residency rights because of an Israeli law that strips Palestinians of those rights if they live outside of the city for more than seven years. The court ruled he was eligible for a residence permit even though he had lived outside the city for more than a decade. Lawyers who have followed the case say justice has been served. It is an important decision. It, it, it can help many people that uh, their permit was taken to, to come back to Israel, to stay for a year and to renew their, their permit and to, to, to live in Jerusalem. It's very important for Jerusalemites. According to official figures, some 14,000 people will now be able to return back to occupied East Jerusalem. But for locals here, the news has been met with some disbelief. We normally see the court align itself with the Israeli government. I can't explain this decision. I can't believe the High Court made such a decision. It's amazing news. The fate of Jerusalem is a long-running flashpoint in the Israeli-Palestinian conflict. Palestinian communities in occupied East Jerusalem are at the forefront of what has been described as a policy of the Judaization of Jerusalem at the expense of other religious communities through settlement expansion and home demolitions. The court's decision is likely to cause alarm among some Israelis who want Jerusalem to be more Jewish than Palestinian. Imran Khan, Al Jazeera, occupied East Jerusalem.